No one saw this coming. John McCain finally did the right thing, Schumer is boiling mad. The Republican endeavor to repeal and replace Obamacare was a fiasco. While not by any means the only one to point the finger at, Rhino and Chief John McCain drove the last nail into that coffin. This ought not to have been a major amazement given his history of restricting conservatives and their causes. Furthermore, almost certainly his ego was all around sustained by that demonstration of double-crossing. For reasons maybe just know to him, he has changed his tune with respect to the tax bill. The left should be shocked that he would have the nerve to abandon them for his own party. Mark it down as one of the considerable demonstrations of his political vocation. John McCain truly is ready for the Republican tax bill. Fortunately, Senate Majority Leader McConnell has reported that he has enough votes to pass the tax reform bill. The Democrats are rendered weak by this. Mr. Schumer can practice his right to call President Trump and the Republican leadership unsavory names. Also, he can regurgitate his standard venom and in addition forecasts of approaching fate. However, fortunately, all he and his kindred Democrats can do other than watch the bill go in anguish. This is a staggering win for President Trump and the Republicans. According to CBS News, Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell announced Friday that Senate Republicans had secured enough votes to pass the GOP's major tax reform bill. We have the votes, McConnell reportedly told reporters when he left the Senate floor after holding a meeting behind closed doors with members of the conference. Majority part whipcorn and reverberated the uplifting news. As noted by the Daily Beast, Senate Majority Whip John Cornyn also told reporters on Friday that Republicans had secured enough votes to pass the historic tax overhaul. We are confident in the 50 and we'd like to build on that, the Texas Republican told reporters. Of course, Senator McCain figured out how to get himself into the news. In any case, this time for the correct reason. CNBC reported on Thursday that McCain signaled he would vote yes on the tax bill, giving Republicans a major boost in momentum to get the measure across the finish line for the American people. McCain's role in killing the repeal of Obamacare over the summer had to give liberals some hope he would stop his party again, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen. Having been exceptionally reproachful of Senator McCain previously, it is fitting now to praise him on his choice to help the Republican tax bill. Presently on the off chance that he'll simply remain in good shape with respect to future Republican activities. The left mistakenly trusts that the legislature will make a superior showing with regards to then-working Americans and spending their cash. Thus their adoration for confiscatory taxation. This bill communicates the Republican conviction that American laborers and the economy do best when cash is left in private hands. The tax reform bill is a win for President Trump and the Republicans. In any case, much more essentially, it is a win for working Americans who will get the opportunity to keep a greater amount of their income, their income.